The Department of Natural Resources says one of the most common pollutants in Wisconsin well water is nitrate. That can be caused by a number of things, from fertilizer to human waste. A retired hydrologist says he's worried housing developments with well water are at a greater risk for this contamination. WEAU's Maria Blau shares what you need to know if you have a well. Danielle and Haley, a certain amount of nitrate is in water naturally. When that level reaches 10 parts per million or 10 drops in every million drops, that's when it could cause health concerns. For more than 30 years, Neil Cook studied surface and groundwater as a hydrologist. Around eight years ago, he began creating a map for Dunn County related to groundwater and started to learn about septic systems. In my whole career, I did not deal with any septic systems. I mainly spent time uh, handling other contaminants and uh, locating water for people. As he learned about septic systems, he became concerned septic systems could pollute wells in places like housing developments. The Wisconsin Department of Natural Resources says that's sometimes been a problem where homes have their own well and septic system on lot sizes smaller than one acre. 30, 40, 50, 100 homes with half acre lot sizes or less and they all have their own septic and they all have their own well, it becomes very unlikely that everybody's going to be able to avoid everybody else's septic effluent. Bruce Reinick with the DNR says septic systems are designed to reduce bacteria and viruses making people sick. When it comes to nitrates, Reinick says and the typical um, system installed in the state reduces nitrate um, content of the waste a little bit, but not a lot. So uh, that's where your setback distances come, start coming into play is for the nitrate contamination. State law impacts those setback distances. It says how far a well can be from potential sources of contamination. Making sure wells and septic systems are put in away from possible pollution is something the Eau Claire City County Health Department does. For existing wells, it also provides testing for things like nitrates. A lot of times we do see nitrate samples between 2 and 10, so not above a health level, but still above what we would consider background levels of nitrate. And those are wells that we really encourage owners to continue to test yearly to see if that nitrate level might be increasing, but on its own, it doesn't pose a, a long-term health risk. Burner says higher nitrate levels could be caused by things like fertilizers, animal waste, or a problem with the septic system. The health department recommends getting your well water tested at least once a year for nitrate and bacteria. We will have links with more information about getting your water tested on our website. In the newsroom, Maria Blau, WEAU 13 News.